Hello, my dears. How are we doing tonight? Listen, I promised and I'm gonna deliver. It's time for Halloween gaming. I, uh, I mentioned this last stream that we would do some Halloween themed games for Spooky Month and uh, it's time. Hello. Did someone say spooky time? It's spooky time. Oh, man. It's, I'm going to be playing Costume Quest 2. You ever see this game? No, I have no idea what this is. It's by, uh, it's by Double Fine. It's by the, uh, the Psychonauts uh, creators. Okay, okay. I'm going to switch over to the game. It's one of those full screen games that doesn't allow you to click off of it. Ah, it's one of those. Yeah, mm -hmm. so I hadn't started it yet. But here it is. There it is. Oh. I like your new model, by the way. Thank you. Yeah, Six made that from for his streams. All of us who are ever in there, like all of his friends are little dolls. And it's like, well, that'll fit here because dolls are a toy. Yeah. For Christmas. Yeah, so I'm into it. It all works out. Beautifully. Beautifully. I don't have any plans to dress up for Halloween. No, Flair. Uh, I usually I have one Kigurumi that I wear every Halloween. Nice. <clears throat> So I guess I am dressing up, but not as anything special. All right. Can I control the game? <laughs> Will it allow me to control the game? Uh. Oh, it's WASDA. Okay, good. Got it. Oh, options. Please let me, please let me not make this game full screen. Eh. Uh. Wind, wind, windowed? No? Windowed mode? <laughs> please? This is not scum. This is normal. I have to do this. Why doesn't it? Are there, are there no windowed modes? Hmm. Okay. This is fine, I guess. Oh, now it looks weird on the stream. You. Game. Be in the center. Thanks. Yeah, it's just one of those games where when you click off of it, there's no sound. Okay, fine. Mm. If you want to be that way, it's one of fine. those games. You can be that way. It's fine. Mysterious portal or exit game. Okay, well, with options like those, how can I resist? <laughs> what if this portal sends us to a crazy monster world like last time? I, I, I'm sure many of you have not played Costume Quest 1, and it has been years since I did. But basically, the costumes turn you into monsters when you're in battle. Oh, cool. Oh, so this is a direct continuation. There's no time to rest. Mm -hmm. Do I get to keep stuff from last time? I don't know how the game would even know that I've played it before. I've always liked Double Fine games. I, I also did just get um, Psychonauts 2 in the mail. Hmm. Oh, I get to pick. Yeah, sure. I like your overworked voice director costume, Vixen. Thanks, I made it myself. Ew, 
little time dilation. That's fine. Don't worry about it. This game uh, is about... It's Halloween. And I don't super remember the plot of the first one. <laughs> that I beat years ago. Um, but, like, again, there's there's monsters, you gotta defeat them, and your costumes determine what you turn into in battle. Like, you turn into the thing that you're dressed as. So for donating for the games, donation option, either uh, exclamation point dono or tip... Or just uh, below the stream, there should be a picture of my face that you can click and you can give a dono. And then I will buy whatever game you specify um, from the wish list. It's got to be from the wish list, but yes. See you, Skit. Thanks for stopping by. <clears throat> oh, do you have like a... Okay, hold on. Sorry, I was reading something. I want to buy a game for stream this list. Aha, a list. Thank you. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I'm gonna make this full screen again. If it's gonna if it's not gonna be windowed either way. Now why isn't it going back to full screen on the on the stream? Just be full screen. Okay. Sure, game. Whatever whatever you want, game. Good evening, everyone. It's time for a Halloween game. Let's figure out what the plot is. <laughs> I'm Real scared. quick, like. Don't be scared. I'm a doll. I can't move. This, this demon reindeer put my soul in this doll. Help! Help! <laughs> I'm stuck here in the internet. Someone, please. You have to keep me company. Oh, okay. Well, when you put it like that, I guess we can hang out. <laughs> okay, Halloween block party. Sure. That's right. Donate. I don't want to give a real amount because someone might do it. Donate money to set my soul free. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna be like, yeah, two hundred dollars. It's like, no, no, no. Someone will fucking do it. No. <laughs> Someone will be like, okay. But yeah, the uh, the the game wish list is games that you guys have requested, as well as just a handful that I want. Mm -hmm. Um, and if anyone donates an amount and says what it's for, I will buy that game and definitely play it eventually on stream. Uh, Crystal, thank you so much for the bits. Much appreciated. Oh, for which one? King of Castles? The King Castles? Hold on. I'm going to buy it right now. Thank you so much for that. Much appreciated. That one's a multiplayer game, isn't it? Yeah. King and... King and... King Castles? King of the Castle? Maybe. Hold on. I feel like Aloha said that it was like a multiplayer I purchase. Thank you so much. I really hate that this game stops playing the music when I click off of it. Mm -hmm. Let's see. I have Wildermyth. I've played it a little bit. It's pretty neat. Monster Sanctuary I have, I think, but I haven't played it yet. I think Piff likes the game a lot. I mean, people have been very nice and have requested games that it looks like I will enjoy, mm -hmm. right? It's a lot of monster-themed stuff. There's someone I follow who's really into Paleo Pines and looks pretty cute. Seems up your alley. Yeah, we played the demo and I really liked it. There you go. Power Wash Simulator. Oh, uh, yeah. Gotta do Power Wash Simulator. It looks Power really Wash fun. <laughs> Hell, yeah. Pal World coming soon. Build. Okay. Can't wait for Pal World. Let 
Okay. So creepy man is pissed that Halloween block party is happening on his block. Simple plot, simple setup. Don't you have to like sign off, like get signatures for that kind of thing before you can actually do it? Do you? Yeah, I've always heard that. Like, like if you wanted to have like a, like something that could be allowed a party, it could disturb the peace like a little bit. You need to get like OKs, like signatures from like anyone in the immediate area where it's like, hey, is it cool if we like throw this party? That way they like can't call the cops on you or whatever. Oh, I think it might be like a town like like they blocked off the block for like a market or something. Oh, I see. That's different. Oh. A time wizard. Yo, the time wizard? The time wizard. The time wizard? Dude, you're time wi wizard? <laughs> this guy looks like he's from Pathologic. Looks pretty cool. <laughs> oh, you can tell it's a double fine game. Yeah. So cute. Ah, uh, talisman that, have un that unlocks the monster gate. You hate to see it happen. Not the Repugians. Now I can use them to get rid of the world of rid the world of candy and Halloween. I see he's a dentist. So he hates candy, you get it? Yeah, that makes sense. Yep. A dental hygiene utopia is within my grasp. You think they'd love candy, because it's like, yeah, kid, have all that candy and uh, I'll see you in a week. <laughs> right? But yeah. No. It is more business, unless like they're the kind of dentists where it's like I want there to be no more dentists after me. Like, no one should have this job if everyone's teeth are perfect and clean. Feels like an episode of Candy. Yeah, it kind of does. Our candy vanished. And our costumes. Totally reset from the last game. Got it. No, so it's like a Samus, like a Metroid game. You, you, you lose all your powers and you gotta start over. Yep. Yoink. Straight into a portal, like you do. The future. Oh, it's our friends. They're adults. Uh. And they're married. The adults are so strangely shaped. So gangly. Me costumes. Yeah, let's go. They look like they have the consistency of, like, Gumby. You can just stretch them out. Yeah. Oh, the future is like... You don't get to see it. There's evil about outside. Oh, jeez. Uh, uh, it's, it's, this is the dental hygiene utopia, you see. Yeah, he's got the brush. That's funny. Brush poster. <laughs> that is funny. It's all it's teeth. <laughs> of course. Look... <laughs> I don't know if you've seen this completely unrelated, but this reminds me um, people are like really pissed about the mob vote going on for Minecraft right now. The, um, the mob vote. The so mob Minecraft. Vote. Yeah. Minecraft does this thing where um, instead of just adding new mobs to the game, they put up like three and then you get to vote on which one you want added. Oh. And people are like pissed about it because every time one gets added, the other two vanish. Like they never, they don't add them eventually or later. Um, so people are just, like, pissed. Uh, and they've started making a bunch of, like, not this style of propaganda poster, but, like, a union we can do it kind of poster of, mm -hmm. like, revolt against the mob vote kind of stuff. I wonder who's winning the mob vote. 
or what the options are. Uh, armadillo, a penguin, or a crab. Ooh. It's gonna be crab and penguin, for sure. Armadillo? I don't know. I mean, they're, they're good, but they're not quite... The armadillos are cute, and they give you wolf armor, which is apparently a feature that people have been asking for for a long time. But that's mm. the issue, is that if everybody votes for crab or penguin, is that it for wolf armor? Like, that's what people are pissed about. Mm -hmm. All right, candy corn, and what's the other costume? It's like a little superhero. Yeah. The cat's like, no, I'm going to brush my teeth. Ooh. Ooh. Bird ninja. Cyborg bird ninja. Corvus bird ninja. Could kids shouldn't be outside with costumes on. You know the law. It's so funny. No candy, no costumes. Dental drone. All right. Oh, we got to fight the bird man. So this is this oh, is the cool. main competitive like, costume into, quest. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Right. That's pretty cool. Do you get like costumes you can switch out later or do you just like upgrade yeah. costumes? Oh, cool. So they like are good for different situations. Oh, I see. Oh, I gotta wait for it to go in. Okay, it's not instantaneous. One, one. I think this would alert the <laughs> dentist dictator. Nah, like, oh my god, there's two is... giants fighting in the middle of the city! Don't worry about it. Okay. Okay, that's the timing. I like his animations. I like how he kind of comes forward again. Special abilities. How do I? How do I switch to it? Oh, there we go. Okay. Thanks, Crow Man. I appreciate it. I was the best fighter in Rapugia. Now I teach kids basic moves. That's fine, I guess. Okay, thanks. Find a family of witches guarding a monster gate. I don't know where they are exactly. Sending you back. Sending you just before Dr. White went back. Find them before he does. Okay. Jesus. They're about to get killed by dental drones. Get out of here, Jello. I'm trying to be seasonal and festive. Are these the witches? Did we find the witches? No, false alarm. 
These are standard human children. They do not have the talisman we seek. Okay. You are also looking for witches and are not the witches. If you're looking for the witches, that means you're in our way. We are shards of the chrono... Chronoculus? Ah. Spooky. That sure is candy corn. <laughs> What, uh, what does the candy corn do? Candy corn has better things to do. <laughs> Nothing? Oh. Hmm. Nice. Candy corn sizes of the situation. I think it's just that I don't get two characters at first, so he just has a useless. The candy corn passes the buck. Yeah, I think he just soaks up damage essentially and is not a useful character until I get him a better costume. Can be going ruminate. Yeah, it is cute. You just, depending on your costume, you get different attacks and powers. I remember last game, there was like a unicorn that I was really into. You are trying on your Halloween costume right now, Flair. What are you going to go as? Alligator. Okay. Got it. Okay, bye, Yellow. Who was that guy? I don't know. What are you doing with that gator? <laughs> All right. Find pieces of costume. Give me that candy. Give me that candy. Jello pops into chat, ruins your credibility, then fucks off. Ah, best friends. Yeah. Tell me about it. I forget what the candy... Oh, it's experience. Mm, maybe. Maybe it's experience. You should kill him sometime. That's a great idea. It's Monty Gator. Yeah, it's my favorite FNAF animatronic. Wheelie boost. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, that gator's wearing a wig. Give me that. Just smack the gator. It's fine, nothing bad will happen. Okay. Yeah. Just smack him. Do this in real life with no consequences. <laughs> Thank you. 
uh, shift being one of the things that you have to click when the rest of the game is WASDA is not very intuitive. A squeaky horn. Smack. Do you have it? Thank you. Debating whether or not you want to get a big silly pumpkin head to wear with the costume. What? I missed. Oh, spooky scarecrow. Okay. Have you seen that? I am not a jack-o'-lantern. My name is Lewis. Have you seen that around? It's... I've seen it all no. over my TikTok page. <laughs> no, I have no idea. Non-spooky scarecrow. I'm sorry. I see. The only... I'm trying to think of any Halloween stuff. The only Halloween stuff I see every year is uh, the guy with the skeleton. And it's like, what's my favorite snack? And he's, and he's just like yelling at this guy to answer. And the guy's like freaking out. I feel like that's someone I know. Did Keston make that? It's either that's Keston a... or Tom Schalk. Oh, gosh, maybe. I don't know. Yeah. One of those guys, I think, made what it. What is a skeleton's favorite snack? I don't I don't know. Come on. What is it? <laughs> it just gets, like, more intense. <laughs> Tom Schalk. Yeah, 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 yeah. Ribs! Spare ribs! Fuck! He just, like, slams the skeleton <laughs> on, like, <laughs> on the wall. It's funny. Got to get a boat to find the bog witches. Oh, no, I've got this clown in my party. Great. Can we get through here? No. Okay. Lily, thank you so much for the bits. Oh, I'm glad that I happen to be streaming today. Come hang out with us. Wait, his name's actually Monty? I wasn't even looking at his name. His name is actually Monty, and he's associated with gators. That's really funny. <laughs> Change into clown costume. Oh, oh, why do you... Why do you do that? Yeah, that'd work. You got a boat? Fill up my pail with candy and bring it back to me. Trick or treat at every house and bring me the mother load. That's a lot. Okay. I don't want to be wearing this clown costume. I don't want to be on heel focus. You can be on heel focus. All right. Also, I don't know if you saw it, but I sent you the money to buy a power wash simulator. Oh, did you? Oh, thank you. Yeah. Now I'll, you can have I'll, the satisfaction of cleaning up house real good. I'll buy it right now. All right. I wish there was a better way for me to see donations come through so that I don't miss it. Does it, like, alert you or anything like that? It does. I should turn the sound on. That's no, what I should do. That's it, because it's like, blah. Yeah. Well, normally I don't want to have it going because we're always talking. And I don't want it to be loud. I guess. It's not super intrusive, though. It's pretty gentle. But I can have just I can have just the donos make noise. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You know how I'm feeling? You know what I'm doing? Donation. Maybe. Audio file. Or, yeah, you can, can make it a specific audio. Thing, I can you? do... I could do holi- there's holiday noise- hold on, there's holiday noises. Oh, there you go.
Yeah, let's go with bells. Save. Test. Didn't make a noise. Oh, I, I have to volume. No? Okay. <laughs> That's fine. Oh, I'm sorry, Illustrating Phoenix. It's something I just recently figured out is that you can't just buy games from the wish list. I have to I have to take it as a dono. Otherwise I would have told you when Yoku's Island Express was three dollars a couple weeks ago. Yeah, I mean I'm sure another big sale will be happening soon as we get closer to Christmas, so Oh, I see, I see, I see, I see. I got it, I got it, I got it. Hold on. Check this out. I'm going to make it louder than that. Yeah. Now when I hear that, I'll know no, that know. one of you bought a game or just game did a sound. or just did a normal dono and I'll look cuz yeah. I don't want to miss it. Thank you so much. I will buy the Power Wash Simulator right now and probably play it soon because I really want to play it actually. Yeah. I do it. But yes, uh, this is a new thing. If any of you guys want to donate the equivalent of the price of a game off the wish list, I will then purchase that game and play it on stream eventually. Um, and it's it's all either games that I personally want to play or games that you guys have suggested. Uh, so there, you know, if, if you suggest a game, you could then... The game will go on the wish list, probably. I do have model refs on my Twitter. Yes, you have to go all the way back. I'm so sorry, but uh, my reveal had a full full body. Oh my god, the clown. <laughs> the clown. That that clown is a lot. Oh, that's a clown. <laughs> Retreat, here's some money. Thank you, Crystal. I appreciate you. <laughs> oh, that was too early. I gotta get used to this clown. <laughs> Get him out of here. Ugh, so close. Damn. Well, he's dead. Under a lot of pressure right now. Yeah. That's yes, I guess you are. It's nice that he just absorbs damage even if he's not a useful party member. Oh yeah, for sure. Like if only you have like a taunt or something, like, oh look how delicious I am or something, and they go after him more likely. 
Mm. But still, that's, that's free hits on him. Ghost Munch. You got your first creepy treat card. Well, that went away so fast. What did it say? It said to equip it, but where? How? Why have you forsaken me? Is it here? Is this where I equip it? Focus in action. <laughs> What's this, what's this space doing all the way over here? What's this little space doing? <laughs> I think it's a free heal between battles because my guys aren't... I have no idea, honestly, how I see any information on any of my guys. Uh, open notebook by pressing J? Okay. Creepy treat. Minions attack damage itself. Equi uh, these cards will be available to use during combat. Oh, it's already equipped. Okay. Oh, it already looks more delicious to enemies and draws more attention just as a passive. Okay, okay, okay. Speaking of candy, I just learned that Sour Skittles in Europe don't have the dust on the outside. Is that better or worse? I feel like it makes them not look any different, but man, it would it would hurt your mouth way less. That's the big problem with the, the dust on the outside, is it hurts your mouth so bad. Sorry, I'm drinking chalky milk. Sounds pretty good. I, uh... I've started making a protein shake every day as one of my meals. And it's mm -hmm. chocolate, almond milk, and banana. Banana. Yeah. Chocolate and banana is peak. I hate this clown, dude. Oh. Look at this guy. Oh. We have strengths and weaknesses. I don't know. I think I'm strong against magic, weak against tech. And that guy's tech? Question mark. Just hit that guy. Oh, thank you so much, Crystal. I will purchase it. Monster Hunter Stories 2. I'll do it right now. Well, three games tonight. <laughs> Gonna clear out this list. Okay, Monster Hunter Stories 2. That's this one. Sorry, chat. We can't play this game because we're too busy getting gifted games. <laughs> getting gifted <laughs> games. <laughs> Again, really wish this game... Well, I guess it's good that it pauses since the, the battle's auto battle. But still, I wish the music would play. So this guy is strong against magic, weak against monster, but also you can do your bounce attack and we'll probably be fine.
Look at candy corn. What games have been donated for? Uh, Monster Hunter Stories, Power Wash Simulator, and uh, King of the Castle. We got all of them, and so we will play all of those eventually. That's a lot of games, though, so it's, we might take a minute. And also, I'm doing Halloween games for all of uh, uh, October, and also Wargroove 2. And then um, we're going to do Stantler Run for, like, November, December, like, ho holiday time. It's going to be good. Hmm. I've got I've got theming for, like, the next three months. And then we'll just play all the games that you guys are buying right now. <laughs> now I'm going to have a lot of choice paralysis. Hit it. Sometimes you get a normal grown-up and they just give you candy and you don't have to fight anybody. It's nice. Let me check again. Strong versus magic, weak versus tech. Yeah, okay, I was right. Got it. Got it. Yeah, I figured this was this was about as Halloween-y as you could get if I was going to do a Halloween game. Oh, Sporon, thank you so much. Monster Train, you got it. My phone keeps lighting up being like, you bought a game on Steam. I'm like, I know. You said Monster Train, right? Yeah, the one that's like seven bucks. Got it. Got it. Got it. I understand. Dunsky. You was totally Halloween impossible creatures. Listen, <laughs> listen, you. God, that game kicked my ass so bad. <laughs> All horror games would be in theme, yes, but I'm baby. And I can't stand most horror games. I actually, like, they actually keep me up at night. Oh, this house is destroyed. <laughs> there's there's nobody there. Got it. Understood. Monster Prom would be fun, and that's one you can do with friends as well. Yeah, I'm in that game. Oh, yeah? Yeah. I'm one yeah. of the... I'm either one of the DLC or... Yeah, DLC? Or, like... You had to donate or something to get them, but I'm one of those characters. I think I have all the DLC for the first one. I don't know what I have. I know I have all three games, but to what extent? I Kickstarter. Don't know. Yeah, Kickstarter backers got my character and a handful of other characters for Monster Prom 2. Oh, this is healing. Okay. Romance yourself speed run. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Can you romance yourself? <laughs> hmm. Will yourself like you? I don't know. Only one way to find out. Play one of those old JRPG horror games like EK or Mad Father. Yeah, I, uh, I'd love to play Eve again. It's been years. I know someone suggested we play Ao Oni, and then they put LOL LaMau.
Yes, I'm one of the playable characters in Monster Prom 2. I'm uh, like a Dulahan. It's cool. I'm having trouble drinking my protein shake because it's frozen at the bottom. You gotta get a spoon and dig it out. Yeah. Oh, it was over here. I know, I know you're hungry. You're thirsty. Shut up. Oh, God. Please. Well, there's all this swamp water, so, you know, just have a little, have a little sip. Yeah, you'll be fine. Yeah, I actually, this, this protein shake does not taste bad. That's good. Yeah. I mean, it's still not, like... Like, anyone who says, like, oh, this protein shake tastes just like ice cream is lying to you. Like, it doesn't. It they tastes like do. protein shake. But mm -hmm. it tastes like better protein shake than usual. I can't stand if it's, like, too chalky. Oh, it drives me nuts. But this is pretty good. And when I add almond milk and uh, banana, it's nice. What's this guy, do you, do you have palm tree? <laughs> okay. Go around destroying stuff. It's fine. That's your deal on Halloween. Nobody can stop you. It's Halloween. You can hit this too. Great. Good. Nice. You did it. Hi, Tiger. What's up, little man? Apparently you have a vitamin D deficiency. Same, Lily. I take gummies for it every day. I wonder how you find that out. You go to your doctor. Uh, fair enough. <laughs> <laughs> I don't have one of those. You, you probably should. I'm just over here like a skeleton. I probably should. I started going to the doctor more seriously in the last like two years. And they're like, you're vitamin D deficient. Also, drink protein shakes. I was like, okay. Oh, a spare. I have to find a spare. I see. Fixing, you think I can afford that? I'm too busy buying streamers video games. Fair enough. Take your vitamin D supplements, kids. Even if you go out and get sun, apparently, like, it's really common for people to be deficient. I was talking to, um... I was talking to someone, and he was like, are you vitamin D deficient? Uh, and I was like, well, I go and I get an hour of sun every day at least. And he's like, ah, that doesn't really help. I was like, what do you mean? <laughs> he's like, you should still take supplements. I was like, okay. Candy Corn believes 
Thanks, Candy Corn. I appreciate it. Help me budget, my family is starving. $10 grocery, $10 healthcare, $5,000 video games for streamers. What can I cut? <laughs> you don't need groceries. this combat system. Someone say give streamer more money? All right. <laughs> Failings in the new Detective Pikachu game sounds like strong bad. <laughs> what? Oh, do they talk? Because they can talk to Pikachu? He needs heels again. He needs some milk. Still I know, sad that man. Danny DeVito is a detective Pikachu, but alas. I mean, wouldn't have really worked in the movie. No, but like, I don't and know. They got a voice actor for the game. It would have been funny though. Because you expect, I mean, it's like a Detective Pikachu. Oh, he sounds like a handsome man. I'm like, oh, oh, sure. Like that's fine. Like that that fits, but that's not like fun. No fun with it. The only thing they could do now is just <laughs> special guest star Danny DeVito as Garbodor or something. That would be funny. Yeah, uh, like that, that would be go. funny. Yeah, or something like poison, gross just... Pokemon. When, when that started, like, popping up as a thing that... Oh, there's one right here. Oh, okay. When that started popping up as a thing that people kept saying, I felt bad for poor Keiichi. Who's <laughs> actually the voice of Detective Pikachu. Yeah, and he sounds fine. He sounds fine. <laughs> but! But! How funny, because you don't expect the voice to come out of Pikachu. So, like, sure. not only is it funny, but, like, it could work anyway. Not the talisman. Oh, Crystal, thank you so much. I appreciate you. Yeah, it's much better to have a sound when the donos go off. I don't <laughs> want to miss them. There you go. I appreciate you guys. Thank you so much. Well, we got to do Psychonauts 2 at some point, right? Yeah. Like, I love Double Fine. I, I want to play Psychonauts 2. I've and like I backed it like a bajillion years ago. I just only now got my hard copy. I say hard copy. It's a it's a USB stick that has the game on it. That's funny. Candy Corn sets the screen is pretty funny. <laughs> Fruit flakes. Hmm. This guy. Doesn't contribute to the battles and then tells me he wants water. <laughs> he just sits there. Sit there, thirsty work. You ever get punched in the face by like a weird demon monster and then you're like, man, I'm pretty thirsty.
Kenny Corn says like and subscribe. Is it starting to fall out of fashion to say that? I feel like I hear it less. Oh, like and subscribe. Um, I think a little bell. bit. Yeah, and ring the bell. Every now and then I still hear those. I feel like it's but, starting uh, to fall out of fashion, though. Yeah, because it's annoying. <laughs> I guess I, like, I understand the need for it. Like, I get it. Like, by default, if I, like, look at my subscriptions and see a video, and then I, like, watch it, I just like it. Like, the first thing I do is I like it as the video starts. Because I already know I'm going to like it. Hmm. Because that's why I'm subscribed I... to them in the first place. So they already get it. I never... I never like anything. <laughs> I don't like or dislike videos. I just watch them and go, hmm. And I move on. I never dislike anything. It's either, like, nothing or... Good job, buddy. I just, I, uh, I'm i weird about interacting with stuff. I rarely leave comments either. No, yeah, me either. Don't, I don't touch comment sections. You gotta be I, stronger than I to leave a comment. I I did have to leave a comment, not on, on a YouTube thing, but on something else recently. So, um, a friend of mine is going to be, at some point in the near future, running a, uh, Pathfinder 2nd Edition adventure path called Outlaws of Alkenstar, and it's just like a Western adventure, basically. Um, and I was like, oh man, I want to play a samurai, because like samurais and West Westerns are basically the same thing, but on like other halves of the world. They're they're hand in hand. Like samurai stuff and westerns copy a lot from each other, or I think Westerns copy from samurais. But anyway, um, I think it'd be cool and they were fine with it. Uh, but there's no like official samurai anything for that system. Mm. Um, so I looked for third-party content, and uh, uh, Paizo, the people who do Pathfinder, have a site called Pathfinder Infinite, and that's where they... It's like the steam of third-party content, basically. Like, it's all we can get a lot of it from there. And it's supposed to be, like, pretty quality stuff. So I found um, an archetype for Samurai, which isn't a class, but it's, like, the next best thing. And I kind of skimmed over the preview, and I was like, yeah, okay, cool. I'm only, like, six bucks. I was like, sure, why not? Like, I'll buy it. And, um... I was looking, there is a Samurai in 1st edition, but not 2nd edition, uh, which is what we're playing. Maybe there's like a conversion thing we could have done, but I didn't feel like bothering with that, so whatever. Um, but anyway, I'm looking at it, and for the most part it looks like pretty cool, actually. Um, but then I get to, so at 4th level you can take a feat that's called, uh, I think it's called like Samurai Banner. And basically you can like plant a flag in the ground, and it's like an area of effect buff for your party, right? They're inspired by your flag. And it's like, look in the uh, Samurai Pledges sidebar, like the pledge you would make as a Samurai, like pick from these, and like that would like uh, add different effects, right? So I'm mm -hmm. like, okay, let me, like, I wasn't going to take this anyway, but I thought it was neat. So I was like, okay, let me like look around and see, like, where's the Samurai Pledge bar? And it's not in the PDF. I like looked through all eight pages very carefully. Not there. So then I showed it to them, like, hey, can you look through this PDF and like... Do you see the Samurai Pledge's sidebar? And they're like, no, it's just not there. And I was like, wow. I feel like that is important, because if you wanted to go down that route, you can't, because you're missing crucial information. Mm -hmm. So I went to go leave a comment, and lo and behold, in July of this year, someone was like, hey, where's the Samurai Pledge's bar? And then I left a comment being like, yeah, where's the Samurai Pledge's sidebar? <laughs> I feel like you should include that. So how do you miss that? It seems like a really important thing. Like, no, uh, well, that's third-party content. Sometimes it's, you know, it be like that. Sometimes it'd be like that. Also, hi Nubby. Um, you can't see me. Hi Nubby. I'm hiding behind Keen. Oh yeah, yeah you. you. <laughs> I'm sitting on you. Sorry. No, no, there you go. It's on me. There you go. But the way it's there, he is. Hey. Sorry, I took There's so a little long. Man. I needed, I needed bunny time. Bunny time. Refreshing. Yeah, Bunny know, time. Sat with my rabbit. Oh, you have a rabbit? I do have a rabbit. What's your rabbit's name? My rabbit's name is Rumi. Oh, oh I got really funny about his bunny. She is white. Uh, I got her from my cousin in Puerto Rico, uh, who is a rabbit breeder. Oh. Uh, basically, when I was over there with my mom just before we left, he came to us and was like, hey, 
We just had a new litter of rabbits. Dude, you want to, like, pick one and keep it? And I was like, hell yeah, dude. Uh, and and I had a rabbit. <laughs> Aw. Cool. I, I used to have a rabbit. His name was Oreo. Oh. You could imagine what he looked like. Yep. <laughs> How do I get back there? I'm playing Costume Quest 2. How do I get back there? Mm hmm. How was your day, Nubby? My day was okay. Yeah, I picked my mom up from the train station, uh, and then basically just was at work all day. Today was clean play day, which means that we take the whole store apart and deep clean everything. So we stay about two, three hours after closing. So I was, I was in a lot later than usual. Um, and yeah, uh, I haven't eaten yet, so I'm really hungry. But I don't know, I'll probably fix something later. <laughs> Get a snack. Yeah. We'll be here. Um, other than that, uh, I, I don't know. I'm probably kind of just like veg out. Maybe play a video game and just, like, turn my brain off for a bit. Hell yeah, uh, dude. Otherwise, I'm here. <laughs> That's me, hey. baby. I was like, I'm... I'm video... I, there's, like, work I could be doing right now, but um, tomorrow's a holiday, so I could do it tomorrow, and it would still be on time. Oh, and I was yeah. like, I want a video game right now. Yeah. I really don't want to fight more guys than I have to. You get out of here. Tomorrow is, uh, what is it? Oh, yeah, it's Indigenous Peoples Day. Yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. Not that other one. I have off from work. But I'll probably do my work tomorrow because I'm not doing it tonight. Oh, I can switch. And then I can. Is it Q? Yeah, let's go, baby. Costume material, greenish yellow fabric. Yes, please give me another costume. I need <laughs> I need this middle party member to not be candy corn. <laughs> Did you come to duel the best? Because I'm the best. The best at what? At dueling. Oh, I see. Oh, uh, because there's a devil. Uh -huh. I need to get a fiddle. I see. Pterodactyl costume pattern? Let's go. No, candy corn for the entire game. Why would I do that? All candy corn run. What do you got? Um... Map of the area. Chosen hero takes two turns. Oh, that's really nice. Um, well, only if it lasts the whole battle. Double candy reward. Stun a minion for three turns. Okay, Tetsujin, thank you for resubscribing. 31 months. You've got a leg up on everybody. Thank you that's, so much. That's a little baby. 31 months... How old are you at 31 uh, months? I guess it's like, that's like not, I guess not really years. a baby. That's well, almost yeah. three years old, yeah. yeah. That's I mean, a yeah, that's toddler. Like, I guess, yeah, there's a difference. They're all babies to me. Until they're that's like... a minion health in half on each turn. That's pretty good, too. Uh, well, I'll get this first. Let me see, let me see, let me see. Chosen here takes two turns. 
I would like that. Please. Okay. Um. This. And this also seems good. I'm into it. Oh, you can't see my candy count. Sorry. I'm sitting in front of it. <laughs> I had enough to buy everything, but I can only equip three cards at a time. <clears throat> Candy tax evasion. <laughs> I haven't used these the entire time. Did you only use them like once ever, or is it like... I don't know. Once per battle, or... We'll find out. Can I just do more? Two battles left. Mm. <coughs> oh, until I can use it again, or...? Probably. Hmm. Interesting. I see. So it's better to save them, I think, for when it's like a serious battle. Mm. Yeah, the candy corn is a damage sponge. Oh yeah, you can get dupes. So I guess maybe, maybe it might go away. In which case it would be better to save for an enemy with a lot of health. Yeah, yeah, relax. <coughs> oh, can't just run past him. Oh, three of them. Get him. There you go. That's a little <laughs> bit disturbing. <laughs> so it looks up at the end. <laughs> Very silly. It's such a double fine ass animation. Oh, for sure. Also, the way the enemies look at each other when when one of them dies. Mm -hmm. Like, holy shit, he's dead! Frank, no! Is this a, a double fine game, or are you just using that as a it is comparison? A, it is a double fine game. Gotcha. 
which is why I played the first one. Cause I was on a, I was on a Psychonauts kick back in the day. Nice. Yeah. Wait, wait, wait. What was that? Oh, learn new combat techniques from Corvus. Do I have to walk all the way back? Yeah, maybe. Curious to see how, like, the other characters look in the superhero costume, or how they look in the clown costume, if there's a difference. Yeah, I don't know. Hmm. Maybe I'll switch up some of their costumes later, just to see. Oh. Oh, I leveled up. That's why. There's a different male superhero when male characters use the superhero costume, but I imagine all the male characters look the same in it. Uh, how do I get up there? Oh, probably the pterodactyl. That would make sense. I already went here. Okay. French Quarter. Neat. Character models. <laughs> Look at all these French people. These are fucking. These are. Uh, what do you call them? Chucksters. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah. Well, You're this Mario is Sunshine. the Chuckster. <laughs> no, you're right. So, what exactly is the plot of this game? Are there real monsters or just imaginary? I think they're supposed to be real. And you can use your costumes to defeat them. <clears throat> and there's a dentist who wants to make a future where dental hygiene reigns supreme and uh, he does that by outlawing candy and costumes and Halloween. So you gotta stop him. I think, uh, I think that's what Christopher Lee did in Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory. <laughs> <laughs> Lollipops. <laughs> so intense. We question? You, you better, you better know it. We costume question. I promised Halloween games. Two, even. Yeah, it is. A costume quest, a dose. Yeah, this month is going to be Wargroove 2, and then some Halloween games. And then next month, I'm going to uh, go back to playing more normal games based on you guys' requests. And also do the Stantler run for the holidays. That's yeah. the overall plan. I'm excited for Stantler Run. Yeah, me too. I really want to play it. Really I'm cool. Just, I want to be on theme. With how hard he hits, that clown's got to be full of bricks. <laughs> it's like it's a big pile of rocks, dude. That's insane. <laughs> There we go. Yeah, the, I mean, the noise he makes when he rolls up definitely sounds like he's really heavy. Well, like, he doesn't react when he gets hit. And when he does that impact, it's like... And then, like, he rolls around and you hear that noise. He's full of bricks! <laughs> Candy corn cam! Funny.
I'm kind of impressed that I haven't seen too many repeats on the little candy corn flavor texts. We wrote 200,000 instances of these. <laughs> Just in case. Uh, candy corn is a damage sponge. It attracts attacks. So it can't attack, but the enemies are more likely to target it. There's an achievement for seeing all the candy corn text. That is, that's funny. I know there's an achievement, at least on the first game, for opening the game on Christmas. Like on Christmas Day. Of just like Halloween on Christmas. And I believe there was like a Christmas themed DLC, like an ice, there was like an ice DLC. quarter yeah what do you got french quarter map Tim paint a chocolate stripe cheese. on your candy corn to add a defensive bonus and increase threat oh i would much rather have that than another card so i guess i'll save up That like shady character. It's like, you remember that, that one side character from Coraline? This is him now. I <laughs> feel old. Yeah. Oh, now. The like, you know, like the kid who like Lying. wants to be friends. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> Candy corn maxing. <laughs> There's only one kid left. And then the world ends. And then oh. you annihilate the universe. Thank you for not making me walk all the way down. First time chatter, hi, welcome to the stream. Welcome to this Whoa. very Halloween-y stream. We're playing Costume Quest 2. But as you may notice, I am a Christmas-themed VTuber. <laughs> You know, normal stuff. Oh, is that the magic type? That's the first time we're seeing it. So that's what you're strong against. Oh. It's not for seeing all candy corn text. It's for using it in the entire game in every fight. I see. Do I want the achievement or do I want my life to be easier? You want your life to be easier. Do it. <laughs> Dino costume. I want Candy dino costume. Kind of stinky. He's <laughs> a little bit stinky. <laughs> this was last uh -oh. year's candy corn. Oh no. Not my candy corn, dude. Candy corn! Donating no. for candy corn run! 
Oh, Crystal. <laughs> you make a tempting offer. Thank you for the dono. <laughs> Much appreciated. Also, I saw someone wanted me to refill my water, so I'm going to do that real quick. Can't be true. Hi, Crystal. Hi, Bo. Uh, maybe next time I go AFK, I won't click off the game because then the stream is just <laughs> dead silent. Uh, it's just me being like, no. <laughs> no, but it's so cold out here. Hold me, please. I'm so cold. I got you, man. I, got I can't you. move. I'll warm you up. I can't it's feel okay. my legs. <laughs> we just got to just stay awake. We just got to make it through the night. So tired. Don't you go to sleep. Don't you go to sleep. You open your eyes. Don't close your eyes, Keith. And I'm already gone. <laughs> no! no! <laughs> and Vincent comes back. Oh, hey guys, what's going? On? Oh my God, they're dead! Oh my God! <laughs> what happened? <laughs> we're just in, like Family Guy dead poses, but we're like colored blue because we're frozen. <laughs> but I'm like more blue. Dude, I'm so sore from working out yesterday. <laughs> that was a, a good, good stretch. Sort of be, it is a good sort of be. <laughs> I set some, ah! I set some good r records on my my weights. Nice, nice. Getting strong. I, I wrote it down. I wrote it down even. Oh yeah. Yeah. What was it? Hold on. What were your records? My, my records. Uh. Let's see. Where are they? Um, 20 reps, 40 pounds for rows. Pretty good. Pretty good. Nice. I think I went, I think I actually went 30. As that was, and then that was, um, upright rows? Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Like with the okay. machine? So 30 reps, 40, which means I got to go up on weight, obviously. Mm -hmm. Um, and then... Chest press, 22 pounds, 20. And then 20 at 40 lat pull downs. Ooh, nice. So pretty good. Pretty good overall. Yeah. And normally I would also do some assisted uh, crunches, but someone stole one of the straps. So there was only one strap on the machine, which oh. was unfortunate. So. Nothing for my core yesterday, unfortunately. We do it later. Well, the most significant milestone I reached recently with my with my weight training, I was able to do I did eighteen reps on on deadlift at two fifty. Ooh. And then for for my leg presses, for my upright leg press, I was able to do um, 20 reps at 200 and then 3 reps at 440. <laughs> Hell yeah. That was just like a, that was just a, a, a victory lap of, I just wanted to see how hard, high I could go. I, was, <laughs> I just put the thing to max. I was like, <laughs> three times. Um, let's see. Uh, I... For uh, squat and press, which is the, um, 
you can if it, it's like a it's kind of like a deadlift into a chest into like a into uh, uh, an overhead raise. Um, I was able to do one one eighty. He's strong. I've been working out. <clears throat> did that one for 14 reps. It's been like a minute. I'm definitely uh, not as good as I used to be, but I'm getting back into it. Mm -hmm. I, it was very helpful. I'm glad I stopped because it was super spency and kind of a scam. But mm. uh, I did for about <laughs> for about a year um, like a year and a half back, I did, um, uh, what's it called, um, CrossFit every day mm -hmm. in the mornings, in like a, in a training class, and it kind of helped me get back into the routine and learn some, like, learn, learn my limits and workouts again, uh, and it gave me a good starting point to go back to my personal training. Of course, when I left, the guy was being an asshole about it. Oh, that sucks. Uh, it was just like, well, I, it, it, like basically, after like, it was like, after like ten months of like working out at this, and I wasn't like, like I was seeing progress, like strength wise and numbers wise, but not really like the kind of progress that I wanted. Um, and I was like, I think I need to like kind of go out on my own. Um, especially because uh, he had just moved the, the gym to like a new location and he was asking that all the members go from instead of uh, 120 a month to 140 a month and that was like just over the threshold of like what I could afford um, with all my other stuff going on and I was like it's just getting to be too much and I can't do it so I have to go and he was like and, uh, like, I, I, I basically I sent him an email. I'm like, I'm going to cancel after this month. Uh, I really appreciate everything you did for, uh, to, to, to help me back in, in my um, uh, fitness journey. And I think everyone at the gym is super cool and friendly. You guys are great. And I hope that you all uh, continue to, to do what you do. And, and that you have, like, you know, th th that you, you're all well. And well and good. And, uh, uh, but I have to, I have to withdraw. And he... He, the response he sent me was just like, hey, man, not going to lie. This really bums me out. <laughs> <laughs> what? And I was like, what's, what's wrong with you? <laughs> like, not cool, dude. Not like, cool. I mean, what, you're going to do it forever? Like, eventually you'd stop. Yeah. yeah. You would have to expect, as someone that runs any kind of business, that people would pull out eventually. Yeah, no. And, like, he has, like, a podcast. Um, it was so funny. And it's like, I have no respect for him anymore. Because, <laughs> um, <laughs> like, he, he, he has this podcast, right? That he, he, like, he puts it up on, like, uh, SoundCloud, and where he just talks about, like, uh, you know, personal drive and, like, fitness goals and stuff. Um, and he, he does, like, an episode a day. Or, like, every week or something. And after I left, he put on... He put out an episode about quitting. <laughs> and he's, like... He's, like... He's, like, the most important thing in your fitness journey is that you keep... That you're consistent. And, like, he says stuff that's true, but it's also incredibly obviously targeted because he like he, he does this specific example where it's like if you're not seeing the kind of results you want after nine months and you just quit then you're never gonna get those results and i'm like dude i told you that i was like what this was about whoa okay i mean he's sitting here like vague posting about me like some 16 year old ridiculous Honk. All right, that is what I have to do. All right. Run up to people, honk. You act 
activate her chuckster instincts and she throws you halfway across the map. <laughs> Go, go over there. Why don't people want to honk your horn at them? Honestly, like, I find, I find the gray alien adults, like the skinny bobbleheads, to be way more unnerving than the chucksters. <laughs> <laughs> Is the is the stream quiet or Flair? Are you are you commenting on your laptop's inability to play the stream loudly? Because uh, I can turn stuff up. I can't turn myself up. I'm I'm about as loud as I can be. Oh, your laptop just sucks. All right, I'm sorry. What about you? Piantas. That's what. Is that what they're called? I just know him by Chuckster. <laughs> Is there just isn't there just like one guy who's I don't know. It's been so long since I've played some Mario Sunshine. <laughs> oh wow. I am I am hopeless if I cannot see my my keyboard letters. Um, my keyboard is backlit, and the backlight is broken, so, like, everything is black, and I have to guess if I don't have good lightning. And I tried to- I tried to type out Mario, and I got, like, Maruuuu. <laughs> it was, like, not even close. There was, like, a U in there. Great. I got music cred. Now I go over here. Chuckster is a title, but Pianta is a species. I'm learning so much. Fifty bucks. Great. I can buy so much candy with fifty bucks. Here you go, child. <laughs> Be responsible. Dude, I'd lose my, I'd flip my lid if I got 50 bucks when I was 10. That's like, that's like 10 grand to a 10 year old. 50 bucks was crazy. You got 50 bucks at the birthday party. It was always like from like the cool aunt and uncle, you know? They're just like, holy shit. I could buy a whole ass video game with this. This is crazy. I can buy a whole week's worth of junk food. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna hit Arctic Circle after school. Who's coming? On me. My aunt just gave me 50 bucks. Oh, that's cute. <laughs> Freeform jazz solo bits with horns. <laughs> <laughs> Comment in chat, what is the best thing you ever purchased with 50 bucks as, like, a, as a kid? As a kid? I don't know. I'm trying to think of when I had 50 bucks as a kid. Yeah, when did I have 50 bucks? Like, never. <laughs> I, can, I, can, Video games, I can remember... Maybe? I remember whenever I went to a con, I would get mm. something, something like 50 bucks yeah. to buy, and oh, I would buy so much manga. I would buy stupid amounts of manga. I remember when I was when I was like I want to say I was like 13 or 14 on an especially good year of Christmas my grandma gave me like it wasn't 50 bucks exactly it was more like 60 but I took that money and I auctioned it on eBay for overpriced Bionicle <laughs> <laughs> hell yeah when you said you auctioned it on eBay, I thought you meant you listed the or 60 like I, bucks. Yeah, no, like I, I bid it is what I meant. <laughs> I was like, what? I bid it. 
uh, to get I'll buy, I'll buy Ionicles that were on auction. Uh, there was well, there was one set that I missed out on, and I was angry that I missed out on it because it was cool as fuck. Uh, it was um, it was a uh, Kadok Godok, I think, which are the Vorok queens, uh, which were basically these big T Rexes, um, and that was the first thing I wanted, and it very quickly outgrew my meager 60 bucks, so I just ended up getting, like, a bunch of smaller sets instead. <laughs> just slam that horn. Love the devil went down to Georgia reference. Very good. You're gonna get your soul eight. <laughs> you are no, not I'm winning fine. this fiddling contest. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Give me that pterodactyl costume, baby. That's insane. Uh, there's one more piece of material that I need. There's a chest up on that rooftop, but I feel like I can't get there without the pterodactyl. My family used to do a thing where uh, my mom would pre-buy all my, you know, Christmas gifts. And then uh, my grandma would get handed just, like, the best one. So I would unwrap everything and be like, oh, it's everything I wanted. Oh, except, like, the, the main thing, like, the best thing I wanted. And it was always over at grandma's house. <laughs> <laughs> so you'd go a little later in the day to get the best gift. Yeah. Be like, Grandma's got it. It's always the grandparents who, who are the ones who are like, I got you. What do you want? A little, little fucking car that you can drive? I'll make it happen. <laughs> that was my that was my dream toy that I never got as a kid. Was, were those little Jeeps that you could drive for like, for like five or six year olds? <laughs> Deluxe candy corn time. Were we both always strong against magic? We could have either of them were strong against literally anything else. Yes, Boron, if you pre-ordered this game, you got at you get access to the costumes from the first game. I don't remember if I pre-ordered this or not. So if I do have access uh, to those other costumes, I have no idea.
I don't pre-order anything anymore. <clears throat> the last thing I pre-ordered was like For Honor um, when that came out, and all I got was like this pin. It was like a little collectible pin, and they didn't even give me the one I wanted. <laughs> it was like a set. You could get a pin for like each of the three fra factions: the samurai, the knights, or the Vikings. And I wanted the Viking one, and they gave me the knights one. <laughs> Damn. Yeah, I uh, I think I've told this story before, but oh, thank you, Lily. Thank you for the dono. Fine, I'll keep the candy corn. Uh, but the uh, the my pre-order experience that really put me off pre-ordering was when I pre-ordered uh, Monster Rancher DS, and I went to go pick it up, and the dude was like, "You know, nobody else ordered this. You didn't have to pre-order it." I was like, "Oh, okay." <laughs> <laughs> I got shamed in a GameStop for liking an unpopular video game. <laughs> you want to play what? Freak. <laughs> Is that the evil dentist? Oh, as a kid. Oh, my candy corn bro's not doing so good. Stop, I gotta fucking rest. He's tired. I'm tired over here. <laughs> I need some water! <laughs> it's important to stay hydrated, kids. But yeah, I mean, like, I pre-ordered um, Psychonauts 2, and like I said, I just got it. But it's been out for a minute. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> well, like, that's not good either. Yeah. Rainbow Cloth. Louder laughs for stronger. Oh, that's clown upgrade, and there's a superhero upgrade. But if I'm gonna get new costumes, like, what do I want to upgrade these ones for? I guess unless I really liked one of them. What this game? This is Costume Quest 2. It's by Double Fine, and we're playing it because it's Spoopy Month. And I'm, I want to be on theme. And when else would I play all my spoopy games? If not October. I'm sure you have, but I'll ask anyway. Have you ever played Brutal Legend? No. Whoa, really? I have right. not, actually. That is probably my favorite Double Fine game. Mm. Don't get me wrong, I like Psychonauts a lot. Uh, Brutal Legend just holds a special place in my heart. Mm. Psychonauts was like my favorite game for like a hot minute. Like if you ask me favorite game for a long time, that is what I would say. <laughs> Gotta upgrade Pterosaur. I agree. I, I really want the pterodactyl costume. I guess like the the pitch is it's like you are you play as Jack Black who gets like ported into a heavy metal themed isekai. Hmm. Um. And it's like a it's like an action RPG. <laughs> Jack Black is actually points negative for me. Oh really? <laughs> Not that I dislike him, um, but it's one of those like I don't know. He's kind of overhyped to me. Yeah. That's fair. That's fair. Where am I going? What am I doing? Talk to Corvus again, but again, do I have to walk all the way back for that? Find that kid that sold our can- right. Uh... I, Did Jack I, Black I, get I, into I... NFTs? I didn't see that. Oh, I had no idea. I don't think so. That doesn't sound right. That, that doesn't sound like something he but I don't know him, but... A lot of celebrities did, though. Yeah. I, Piff I, is raiding! I was Hi, gonna Piff. say... Hi, hey, raiders! I was, I was gonna say that, like, 
Um, I I have like a slight points positive about Jack Black, but like in the way that you're like slightly charmed by like a busker you might see every once in a while and be like, oh, <laughs> you're still doing that, huh? Look at you, man. You're still you're still around doing that goofy thing you do. <laughs> yeah, I think he's a fine actor. I just uh, I don't like how much everyone is like, oh, Jack Black can do no wrong. I'm like, shut up. No, uh, yeah, all, all the um, whenever anyone puts like celebrities on the, on pedestals, like, it's annoying, I and it it, it sucks. But it makes me negatively it makes me negatively look at the celebrity, even though the celebrity didn't do it right. But like, it's just one of those things where I'm just like, if you talk something up too much, I hate it inherently. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> That's just my personality. I I know that it's not reasonable but I also know that I have that reaction hi raiders get comfy we're playing costume quest 2 cause it's spoopy month okay so he put a bunch of leaves and I don't know how to get rid of leaves yet unless it's another thing that the clown costume can handle which I guess is possible Seems like the clown costume can do a lot of things. And my superhero costume does literally nothing. Nope. Okay. Oh, you can eat candy for insta-heals, but why would I do that when candy is also money? Pay to win has gone too far. Yeah, I assume the pterodactyl, but I don't know how to get the last pterodactyl piece. Because, like, there's a chest in there. But that's also blocked by leaves. Unless I can go around? Okay, okay, okay. Is this it? Nope. Card. Hmm. Oh, fall onto the roof of the house. That's a good idea. Okay, I'll go back there and see. Got him. Chess on the roof have the last, has the last piece. Okay. It's taken me a few months of watching you on TikTok and checking your Twitch bio to realize that your name is Vixen, like the reindeer, not just like a sexy lady. You get it. <laughs> I definitely, uh, you know, the 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 name is uh, intentional double entendre. Thank you for coming over after watching on TikTok. Really appreciate you. Hasn't been any TikToks lately because Piff busy, but I know what the next one's going to be. Wait. totally throw Piff under the bus. No, I'm saying I'm, th I'm letting him do his other job. Oh. <laughs> I'm not blaming him for it. But he just has to, he has to do it. Uh, 
I respect that Piff has other bigger editing jobs to do than my little TikToks. Uh, I do know what the next one's going to be, though. But I only have one lined up, so it's not like there's even that many waiting. Yes, a, a vixen is a sexy lady. It can also mean that. It can also mean, I believe, a female fox. There we go. Dino slippers. Hell yeah, baby. Let's go. Yeah, and wing flapping is the environmental effect. Exactly as I thought it would be. That is exactly the costume worn by the villain from Scooby-Doo 2 Monsters Unleashed. <laughs> Give me my candy bag, kid. My mom will let me trick or treat. His name is Oral. That's funny. Jesus. Candy? <laughs> Who are those costumes? What? My candy. Oh, that's a crime. <laughs> so obviously that's our villain in the past. You can't just you can't just throw things at children. You're going to jail. <laughs> Uh, before I get on the boat, I should probably look at those other leaf piles, now that I have winglings. God, where were they, though? We're zooming, so baby. Fast. Holy shit! Yeah, when there's no enemies on the map, I don't have to worry about running into them. I think I've killed all of them. Again, like, shift is a really weird key to hold down when you're... when the game is Wazda, but, like... Mm -hmm. It's fine. Yeah, here. It's better than control, but, yeah. I hate games that make sprint control. <laughs> I generally prefer shift over that but I think the best thing you could do is double tap W thing is the other shift doesn't work oh. like the shift on the other side of the keyboard doesn't work it has to be the one that's near Wazda which is really annoying mm -hmm. why do I say Wazda like that because it's faster than saying WASD mm -hmm. we all know what Wazda is you know what I mean when I say Wazda It's like I have to use my left hand to hit shift and my right hand to use Wazda if I want to do this with any sort of frequency. Mm. It's just a weird choice. Well, my pinky kind of rests pretty comfortably on shift already if I Wazda. No. But I don't like pressing down with my pinky for a long time. Yeah, I don't like that. up oh god you have no idea what wazda means what are the first four letters <laughs> get in the boat I love 
Keen's new PNG tuber. It's Keen's. Yep, that is Keen. That is uh, that. That was drawn by Six. It is very good. It is. Uh, it's of your boy, right? Um, I'm blanking on his name right now, but from uh, from horse game. <laughs> I want to say it was horse game. Right, Keen, is that? What your your little your little guy is right now? I'm, I don't remember his name. Was it KJ? Yes. Yes, KJ. From uh, the Tomb of Horses from way back when. Yeah, that was a while ago. Yeah, I like KJ. I haven't had a chance to do anything with him in another game yet. I mean, maybe I could have, but like, eh. He was um, he was Pathfinder one, and so he was a cleric with the life and water domains, so healing and water. Um, and he had an item called the it was the decanter of endless water. And depending on what word you say, the water comes out at different levels of pressure. So like either a little bit or like a geyser, and it just <laughs> like you know blasts up. Uh, and he was fun to play. He was just a little soft boy. He was a little fella. My he just charged me 50 like bucks a... for an ore. <laughs> My PNG YouTuber is just like a fucking guy. Dude, ores cost like 50 bucks. That's, a cool guy. <laughs> like, that's actually pretty accurate. <laughs> like, like an ore for like a kayak or something. They spency. Surprisingly. Call it Dick's Sporting Goods for a reason. <laughs> Actually, I've been curious what's Nubby's PNG tuber from? Anything? No, he's just a guy. I'm just a guy? <laughs> he's just a guy I made up. <laughs> Sometimes you just gotta make up a guy. You just the, gotta make up a guy. The his, top uh, parts of his. Oh god. You, like you, you feel free to refer to me as Ro or, or as Nubby, but the idea was making a a Sona. His name officially is Rohan. I don't care. It's just me. <laughs> but it's a guy I made up because my friends were all making Sonas, and I was like, I guess I'll do one too. <laughs> He's just a little guy. <sighs> Slap a gator in real life, kids. It'll work out fine. No, it's good. They're like big cats. They love it. It's actually very easy to keep an alligator's mouth shut if you are if you get there first. But they're very fast, so don't try it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they suck at opening their mouths, but they're really good at closing them. Literally, like, how how people who deal with alligators, like, regularly, they just put a rubber band over the alligator's mouth, and it just... Yeah, it. They and they, just like, like duct it. tape it. It's yeah. Like, <laughs> the alligator's like, this sucks. <laughs> I can't do anything. Then you have to watch over the tail, but otherwise they can't do shit. What's the difference between an, a Sona and an OC? For me, pers well, technically there Nothing. is none. A Sona <laughs> is an OC. But, but the Sona I, represents you. Yeah, the Sona represents you. It is something that you've created specifically to like, be a proxy for you. Mm -hmm. And then an OC is just like a character that you made. Yeah. An original character. That is not necessarily reflected on you. A Sona, being a Sona is like a title. Being an OC is like a species. <laughs> sure, there you go. Like, like, like Chucksters and uh, and just scrolls up because I already forgot what they were called. <laughs> Pizas or whatever. I don't know. It's off the chat. Paisanos. <laughs> that's it. Yeah. Hey, Paisanos. It's the Super Mario Super Show. <laughs> Kianta. 
That's close to Paisana. <laughs> Shit, gamers. Oh, fuck. It's a guy. It's Yoda. <laughs> This dude's creepy. Yeah, he's like legit. Spooky. Oh, terrible. Let's go. Yeah. Cool. So good. Oh, uh, why am I standing? I should be flying. You should be flying. Go, Candy Corn. You <laughs> go, Candy Corn. You got him. You got him. Just throw the candy corn at him. Kick huge. his ass! Ooh, nice. Oh, but I'm not strong against magic anymore. That kind of sucks. Do you have any of those items that, like, cut their HP in half or whatever? Oh, yeah, I've got... Cards. Let's go for that. Yeah. Oh, he's not a minion. Oh, because he's not a minion. That makes sense. Ah, uh, okay, well. Fine. What about... That doesn't work either. Uh, give you the ability to take two turns at a time. Huh? Now you're fucked. Eat bricks, kiddo. <laughs> 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 the pterodactyl was perturbed about that. If you hit my candy corn, brother. The pterodactyl was perturbed. <laughs> Clown does pretty good damage. You should be just flying in your idol. Yeah. You have the technology. Why are you standing? <laughs> Hell yeah. Egg bomb. Egg bomb. Ippy Blockhead, thank you for the bit. Much appreciated. Oh, and thank you for the gifted as well. So lovely of you. Do you guys like all the new animations? Look at that. Oh. So cute. Who did that? I commissioned an artist uh, whose name escapes me at the moment. I will look it up after this fight. A clock has its own health bar, but also I could just kill this guy. Like, he's pretty low, but I assume he will turn back any damage I do if I don't just kill this clock. Yeah, the clock is probably important. But also, uh, Clown is strong against magic, so let's get rid of this guy. Lived on one. Yeah, just get rid of him. Candy Corn was, was born, born in, in Philadelphia. Philadelphia. <laughs> <laughs> it's what? good. Well, ain't that something? <laughs> Is that true? Is Philadelphia where Candy Corn was conceived? It either means that or it's like this Candy Corn. Was I, born in Philadelphia, I hope. I thing. hope there's some truth behind it. The Candy Corn was invented in Philadelphia. Ah. Okay, Thank okay, you. okay. Thank you, Costume Quest 2. You taught us something today. You learn something every day. Also, yes, for the person who's asking, I'm a demon reindeer, hence the fang. And like the crackly antlers full of demon energy. Oh yeah, my my that's my velvet. 
waiting to burst, and once they do, it'll be the end of all of us. <laughs> Only your viewership holds back the, the ever-burning time. Does that mean we're, like, prisoners bound in your icy kingdom? <laughs> That's well, not if you want to be here. <laughs> I do want to be here. I thought we were friends, Jesus. No, no. <laughs> I, I just, <laughs> I'm, just, I'm just, I'm sorry, I don't want to hurt your feelings. <laughs> Hugs you, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I take it all back. Good. And I whisper to the camera, see, this is how she gets you. <laughs> <laughs> What foul temptress is this? Playing video games? Why, I ought to. Why do you have a candy corn? There's an achievement if I use the useless candy corn all game. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> Does what it can. I I wish he did that to the candy the corn. The candy corn. <laughs> <laughs> that would have been so funny. I don't know how long this game is. Yes, Genesis, I did see Anaris' new announcement. I'm pretty sure. Did you know? Did you know? Yes! Yes! <laughs> Stunned candy corn. Nice. I'm pretty sure I gave Anaris uh, her first anime role way back when on Kimono Friends. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. She played Porcupine for me. That's amazing. <laughs> he just keeps attacking so the candy happy. corn. Let's go. <laughs> candy corn meta. Like, yeah, we're already fighting this guy, and he seems like a pretty big deal, but, like, we've only gotten one extra costume. Oh, bro, come on. All right, I'm aiming for the clock this time. You don't attack my clock. You don't want to hit this clock. You really don't. Oh, okay. oh, six and a half hours? Okay. So maybe two streams. It's a choice. Oh, I can't hit the clock again. And he's full health again. Oh, no. I'm confusion. Am I, am I doing something wrong here? It could be an instance of you need to output as much damage as fast as possible. Because the clock is only targetable for like a turn. Six and a half hours is nothing. Remember beat extreme? No. <laughs> VOD's not available, so it never happened, and I can't get in trouble. Where's your proof? You don't have Think that. about it. It didn't happen. <laughs> Maybe clock keeps damage? Maybe. Next time it's targetable, I guess we'll see. Vixen beats the memories out of that stream. <laughs> <laughs> the memories of that stream out of us, rather. Yu-Gi-Oh! Watch-along stream? I never promised a Yu-Gi-Oh! Watch-along stream. What are you talking about? 
What do you mean? Just cause, we're just going to start, like, totally gaslighting new watchers being like, you remember that time we all watched uh, the entirety of Bleach in one sitting? That was crazy. <laughs> one Piece stream took fucking forever. <laughs> yeah, I can't believe you missed it. <laughs> I love the way he presents his clock to you, it's so... Oh, I hope no one attacks my weak spot. <laughs> it would be just terrible. Oh, if Candycorn's getting low on health. My king. Save your special abilities and just attack the clock. I see. Good. Please attack someone other than Candy Corn for like a minute. really use my special right about now. Oh, there goes Candy Corn. No! The end of an era. Without him, we are lost. Okay, clock does keep its damage. That's good. What's even the <laughs> point went... anymore if there's no clock? If there's no candy corn? <laughs> oh, this? It's just my special little item. Don't pay any attention to it. Got it. It <laughs> explodes. <laughs> no, stop that. All right, time to get rid of the healer. Night Frozen, thanks for stopping by. Clown got kind of a donk though. Flare, I should ban you for that. <laughs> <laughs> How could you say that in my stream? <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> Death by egg. But at what cost? Ooh. Max out one hero's special meter is pretty good. Alright, bye. Evil baby dentist. Sub dude. You just gonna stand there? That's fine. I need to heal my candy corn brother.
Fix him. What other reason is there that the clown bounces so well? Flare. <laughs> I love, I don't know if it's because he's beat to shit, but it looks like, um, what's his name? The kid wearing the, uh, uh, candy corn costume? Mm -hmm. Monty? Maybe that's the No, one. Monty's the other one. The clown. This is uh, Reynold. It looks like he's looking at your feet so he doesn't get lost. <laughs> <laughs> he's tired. <laughs> play pretend you just make me stand there. <laughs> you just make me be candy corn <laughs> how is the dino so far i feel like better than superhero like i feel like i'm doing more damage but it does have the same strengths and weaknesses as the clown which is a little unfortunate God, I keep missing. Have a good night, Master Sword 2. Bye. Oh, their strengths and weaknesses are not the same anymore. What is... I don't quite understand. <laughs> Great gamers. Oh no. Reynolds, Reynold, you don't get it. Candy corn's the most important part. Without I you, we're, we're lost. Like, I don't want to beat candy corn anymore, man. I'm tired of not doing anything. What? Is there any consequence to dying? I guess I just don't get that EXP. But Was like, that the first time you died? Yeah, I haven't died yet. No, yeah, I can only heal with the clown's um, super move, and that takes a minute. Gotcha. Yeah, Candy Corn's really defensive, and it it's a damage sponge. It just doesn't do anything other than that. Vegged out so much that I forgot I was gonna play a video game. <laughs> 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 I'm just sitting here like brain dead. <laughs> you know, sometimes it'd be like that. It's work was hard. <laughs> work was tough. -o. Clown upgrade and superhero upgrade. No pterodactyl upgrade. No deal. Yeah, th there are those leaves, but it just gets me into that area I've already been in. What have you got? The same stuff. Okay. Never mind. Uh, I need a note to self. If I work late, I should cook before I go to work, because now it's like I have no food. <laughs> oh. No, oh, yeah, if you mean these leaves, guys, like, I've already been in here. That, that's not what I... Like, there's nothing in here. I could order something, but I've been Differently? So what quickly. leaves? Oh, you know what? I got watermelon in the fridge. I'm gonna go crazy. <laughs> I 
As a Digimon connoisseur, what's your opinion on Cyber Sleuth? Cyber Sleuth was okay. Um, I felt like it was a bit too much of a generic RPG rather than being a Digimon game. Oh, what about these? Snail. Oh, this is a battle. Oh, that's cool looking. <laughs> Luckily, I have all my super moves. Giant enemy snail. Now that's a dumpy... Chris, you can't just say things. Dumpy doesn't mean anything if you apply it to everything. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm talking about? It's not. It's not. Did I say that or did flare? Are you trying to trying to throw flare into the bus now? Shells are ass. No, they are not. <laughs> just, just imagine. Demonstrably, they're not. Just came up with the worst pun ever. It's just like, hey man, how is it working at the landfill? Oh, you know, kind of dumpy. <laughs> <laughs> Crystal succeeded once already? What? No! Oh! No! Like some kind of conspiracy going on. <laughs> I'm sorry, Flair. <laughs> I blame the... What? No! No. That was... You're gaslighting me. You're gaslighting me right now. Conspiracy. I swear it was Flair. The second time it was... Oh, you tricked me. Why would I... Pull up the logs. <laughs> Pull up the log. You can see. There's a way, right? There's a way I can see your chat log. I, I could probably do it. Yeah. Check the tapes. I can check the tapes. Mod view. How did I mix you two up? You have different colored names. <laughs> it's totally flare, guys. Vixen already said. <laughs> now I'm suspicious. Is there anything else I need to do in this area before I go back to Corvus? Nope. Just go back to the time hole. Okay. Well, surely there's a way to go past a certain point. What? What? <laughs> I already traded the dupe card. Dig a hole. That's the answer. I need you to remember where I buried this clock and dig it up in like 15 years. Yeah, 20 years. <laughs> I 
<laughs> what do you promise? <laughs> oh, I lose a party member? And I don't have clown? That sucks. The Tooth Academy. Hmm. He walks in. Now, who said that clown had a dumpy? <laughs> <laughs> it's just a goblin. I know. It's the best holiday ever. Debatable. <laughs> He's still talking about Flair being falsely accused. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> A long cutscene. All right, what is what I'm gonna do? <clears throat> First, I'm gonna go back. We're gonna see. We're gonna see what Flair has said throughout the stream. I'm gonna get to the bottom of this. <laughs> there you are. Okay. Okay. Let me read chat history. Nubby's on the case. All right, all right, all right. There's you getting upset. I'm gonna keep scrolling. <laughs> A twenty-two eighteen. At, at, at 22 hours, 18 minutes, Flair, Gun Calamity, is guilty for saying Clown got kind of a donk, though. <laughs> Was that what we were debating over? I don't know. I have no idea. <laughs> what, did, what did Crystal say? What did Crystal say? Let's check. Let's check. Let's check the tapes. <laughs> <laughs> guilty, guilty on part of claiming that the clown had a donk. However, if we check the tapes and we go <laughs> to Crystal, Crystal Clear Entertainments and we see, we see. <laughs> Let's see. Scrolling up. Hmm. 
Crystal Clear Entertainment says, how else do you think the clown does so much damage? Reciprocating the, the reciprocating the intention of clown having a donk. <laughs> also saying just after, what other reasons is there that the clown bounces so well? <laughs> I see. And I blame Flair for that. I'm so sorry, Flair. <laughs> Remember, this was if the dog doesn't fit, you must quit. <laughs> <laughs> Don't say that shit in my street. <laughs> anyway, you're both guilty. <laughs> the judgment is death. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> but like, you know, at your earliest convenience. Kills you, kills you, kills you. <laughs> I think Did... Nubby said that. <laughs> if the cheeks don't bounce, you must recount, please. <laughs> Very far away. Now I just have the power of raising my hand. Huh, huh, huh. First time chatter, hi, welcome to the stream. I, I'm i Vixen, I'm a Christmas themed VTuber and we're playing a Halloween game because it's spoopy month. Oh, I can use these. Oh, okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. You emote spamming in Tooth Academy. No. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> oh, get a load of this. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What they doing? It's human. Oh, I can't zoom. Contrary to popular belief, raising your hand does not make you more aerodynamic. Which is a shame, really. <laughs> yes, Vixen, I see your hand raised. Do you have a question? <laughs> oh, Why now my power is handshake? Why does a Naruto running do you run faster? It just should. Because I said so. But it doesn't work that way. This is gonna be annoying. I'm trying to open a can, but I clipped my nails yesterday, so it's like, yeah. There we go. Oh, a soda can. I, yeah. my like, <laughs> not like a I, can opener can, I, like a can, really, like a can. Opening a can of chili by prying it open. <laughs> yeah. yeah. No, that would be a lot harder than a that can be of uh, Beast Unleashed Scary Berries. Hard, six percent. Yum, you want to know the fastest way to intimidate me? <sighs> Open a can with your nails. <laughs> <laughs> that are clipped, too, so you I have, like, no not, nails. I, I will be gone. <laughs> oh, get the fuck out of there. I'm not If any of us could do it, it's you, because you have, like, the muscle, and I I just have fingers, so. Oh, no, at all. I don't... I don't yeah, was... I mean, I'm not going to jam my fingers through tin. Hey! <laughs> not <laughs> that attitude. That's 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 only what a, a weakling must would say. We must train. You must reach the next level. That's okay. Not the kind of training I want to do. Well, 10%. why not? Strong versus tech. Uh, I Focus would rather tech. be strong versus monster. Weak versus tech. Strong versus tech. Weak versus magic. Keen, I'm only training so that I can be pretty. Oh. <laughs> you don't need to train for that. Oh. Focus nuke. What does that mean? Like, I mean, I'll it try it. Focus nuke. I don't know. I guess you have to find out. Yeah, I gotta, I gotta do at least one battle and find out. You dressed as Paul Revere? No, it's Jefferson. 
It's Jefferson Rivera. Yeah, you know the one. You know the yep. guy. How are you today, Oz? How's it going? I'm doing pretty okay. Had work this morning, slept a bunch, and now I'm playing Final Fantasy like a madman. Nice. Oh! Oh, I took the meanest nap earlier. It was Hell awesome. Yeah. Is it the meanest boy? Hello. Hi. How's that boy? Uh, burp. Um, oh, that's he weird. wants me to play Mousy with him, but he uh -oh. gets bored of Mousy within five seconds and then forgets what's happening. Not in like a concerning way, just in a I don't wanna anymore kind of way. Yeah, my cat's done with toys very quickly. As well. My rabbit's done with me very quickly. <laughs> she lets you know, too. Yeah, she decides when it's no longer time for me to pet her. <laughs> Let's go, gamers. Pterodactyl time. The Jefferson costume. It's a Halloween costume, okay? Uh, I don't know when I got that, but okay. Is there an auto sort button in here? All right. What is this? Yeah, okay. I don't have any heals, though, which is... What are you playing? This is Costume Quest 2. Okay. Different costumes give different powers, and you can swap them around. Person's name is Serendipity. What? That's, That's quite crazy. That's quite the name, ma'am. That's crazy. That's crazy. Where the fuck is? Crazy. Where the fuck is? Uh, uh, no, no. No. Okay. I keep clicking on the wrong bitch. Hold up. It's like Ball in Wonderland if oh. a convict didn't make it. Oh my god. <laughs> hey bud, sorry about that. Uh you <laughs> <laughs> left he left me again. <laughs> I left you to die in Revenant's toll. Oh, this is a very interesting art. Well, why is he so tall? Why are you so long? <laughs> you know. Fuck? You know what Jefferson looks like. I actually don't. As a Canadian, I could not tell you one America man from another. That's fair. Well, that's actually. what he looks like. <laughs> yeah, this is yeah, so sure. historically accurate. Whatever. That's fine. Who cares, really? <laughs> yeah, it's whatever. Ooh, what is this? Nina Cita jacket. It's a candy corn, Oz. Oh, yes. Course. That's not a funny penguin or, or a, uh, a snow run. I like your new outfit. Thanks. Okay. Oh, we're so pastel together. Yeah. How cute. Point. <laughs> Point. Point. So we got. We got a pterodactyl, a candy corn, and uh, Timothy Chalamet fighting something. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. I guess this is a demon. I suppose. Must be. Yo, there's there's a lion man in pastel pink Adidas sweats out here in the street forging stuff. Uh, are they putting on a show? They 
They're going at it. I think they're just dancing or something. I, I think that was an ability. Yeah. Oh shit, look at that Lollipop though. Holy shit, they're break dancing. Why are you big? Why are you so huge? Me? No. Vixen and like. Oh, oh. No, no, no. Why, why everybody's so big? Oh, in the battle, in the fight. Yeah. Uh, I don't know. That's just how the fights are stylized. Yeah, everyone's oh, giant. Okay. Cause normally you're <laughs> this little dance. <laughs> normally you're just kids in costumes, but okay. then when you go into battle, you're you're actually the thing that you are. Oh, it's like imagination okay. powers, I guess, kind of. Oh, maybe. Your, yeah. Your health bar is rockets. Sorry, Smarties. Oh, oh yes. yes. <laughs> I was like, all, huh? I was like, like, what are you, you talking the, about? The, you can hear the <laughs> dial up on all the Americans. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yeah, the XP bar is smarties. <laughs> we were all just like, uh. We were like, uh, what? Uh, <laughs> nuh -uh, nuh -uh. What did you call them? Rockets, dude! Rockets. They're fucking rockets! From what I've heard, rockets are like smarties, but good. Yes. Um, they're like I don't know smarties. if you know this, Oz, but rockets go to space? <laughs> well! <laughs> That's what I was picturing. I was picturing like a space uh, rocket. rocket. I was like, what are you talking about? <laughs> I was like, huh? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm just gonna follow you around. Yeah, no, that's fine. This is how you're gonna catch you're, up you're to local. me. You're <laughs> local. You're showing me around. Yeah, yeah, exactly. And this is where I went to school. I hated it. I don't even know why I'm here. <laughs> In fact, they told me to never come back to this town. But they can't do anything about it. Is there a water fountain? I have too much money. Here? I have too much money. My mother owns this city. <laughs> Wait. Wait. Oh, if there's so a hide cute, and seek, dude. if there's a hide and seek side quest, I should check inside the school. She's so freaking cute, dude. Oh my gosh. Goldsmith. Actually, I haven't registered with this guild yet. Oh, you guys are playing a different game. I understand. Yeah. I was like, for uh, a minute, I was like, what the hell are you guys I, talking about? I am so sorry. I will pay attention. <laughs> no, you don't have to pay attention. I was just confused. Yeah, no, I, I saw that Oz also was playing the game I was playing, so I started following him. <laughs> I see, I see. Okay, no, yeah, there's no one hiding. There's no one doing the hide-and-seeks inside the academy. And she's the guild master, so we get to talk to her all the time. I'll just point at Oz and Union and go, Canadian! <laughs> Hey! <laughs> hey! <laughs> Be nice to me! <laughs> what? There's nothing wrong with being Canadian. Yeah, but you should be pointing at me. That's mean. <laughs> that is mean. It's quite rude. Here, come, come here, come here. Stop, mm -hmm. stop, stop, stop. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Man, tell me when you got upgraded for the pterodactyl. Right now. Shit. You just gotta... Put the wings on and go. Wee. How new is this game? Oh, it's a couple years old at this point, I'm sure. Oh, okay. It's got a very cute little art style. Oh. Yeah, it's by uh, it's by Double Fine. I don't know. The who that the Psychonauts is. people. Oh Psychonauts yeah, people. that checks yeah. out. Okay. The password is Chocomana. Chocomana. Can we get into the compound to save Lucy and Everett? The stakes are way high in this one. <laughs> Oh. 
I got to I got to use the Jefferson costume. I see. Hold on. Give me that. Okay. Do some deliveries, which is code word for do the trick or treat mechanic again. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Give me that candy. Anyone else have a note in here? Anyone I need to talk to? Is it your fucking pillowcase full of candy at the bottom there? Yeah, yeah. It's so cute. And candy is, um, also the currency. You can also auto-heal by eating it, but, um, it's not a great Ooh. idea. Since it's also your currency. Deliver this bag of sugar to the client, but don't eat any. I just genuinely there. thought you were going to say, deliver, deliver this bag of shit. <laughs> <laughs> Put it on your boss's front step. Hey, Corvus. Teach me more. <gasps> when did I get this? you're agile enough, you can get an extra attack on your enemies before they know what hit them. If you land a well-timed blow, you'll see another opening to attack. Okay. That is nice. Thank you, Corvus. Oh, that guy's a bird! Mm -hmm. Yeah, he's a bird man. Kind of with no explanation. He just bird is a bird ninja, man. A robot eye. Very important bird man. Oh, I was, I was waiting for you to come back out of the cutscene, but you're just somewhere else. Now. Yeah, they teleported me outside. <laughs> I'm gonna need this frog to leave me alone, please. I can help. Kill his ass, dude. Get him. Wizard. 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 Ooh. Whoa. Oh, it put me back in the superhero costume. No, I want to be a pterodactyl. That's all I've ever yeah. wanted. You could be a sorry. dinosaur and fly. Mm -hmm. Two things every kid wants. The future is bleak, isn't it? How do you know it's the future? I got a new minion. You got a new minion? Oh, it's a little man. Yeah. Oh, I got Technically keep not a dinosaur, it's a pterosaur. But it's wow. fine. We've got experts in chat. You can, uh... You, you, there is a, a good amount of dinosaur knowing people in your chats, I find. Dinosaurs are cool. My favorite dinosaur, Sabretooth. Yeah, that's a good dinosaur. <laughs> that's my favorite. Pretty cool. Look at them choppers. It's not really a dinosaur, but Dinosuchus is pretty cool. <laughs> what is he? Giant alligator. Oh, those, yeah. My favorite sauropod would be like a... Probably just... 
classic Spinosaurus. Mm. Big, big guy that we still can't figure out. <laughs> Scary. They scare me. Nobody knows what they are. <laughs> I don't know enough about prehistoric creatures, clearly. Thinking about the big sloths. Thinking about that megafauna. Yeah, ground sloths. There were some big ass deer. Some big yeah. ass yeah. elk. Oh, mm -hmm. yeah. Some good shit. My favorite got so cold, animal they need animal to be is bigger. elk. Wow. Don't get me wrong, I love my bunny. But deer are just kind of cool. <laughs> they just are so fantastical. You know? Damn. <laughs> Damn. I'm feeling all kinds of flattered. <laughs> Oh, yeah, I guess that would be, yeah. <laughs> Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. Well, no. you don't see me as a deer? What the I, fuck? They're clearly deer. I'm sorry, human-shaped person. <laughs> wow. It's not my fault. No, it's just one of those deer sauropods. It's, it's good. It's just, you're right, you're right, you're right. I'm very sorry. I'm sorry. Don't you know anything about rude. dinosaurs? Yeah, I don't know what came over me. You are, not only are you a deer in my heart, you are the best you are dear Thanks. my heart, and you are uh -huh. dear to me. It's just, she's just like, deer. I really like deer. Oh, I never noticed you were a deer. And it's like, what do you mean? I just, what do you uh, mean? It, was, it was more of, I just wasn't thinking about that <laughs> at the time. I stretch. That's funny. <sighs> when you're stretching, it looks like you're whispering something to Oz, like a little secret that us... Oh, secret. <laughs> That, that us on the other side of the screen oh, cannot hear. Oh, you don't hear. get to know. We're talking about the, talking <laughs> about the swimmer, the summer suit, bathing suit. Yeah. Oh, man. It's I wonder what they're talking about. Nubby's dead. What? <laughs> yeah. Was I being spoken to? I'm no. Sorry. Yes. No, because we're on this side of the screen, and they're having their little secret conversation over there, so oh, we're left to wonder right, what they right, are talking right. about. Yeah, um, it's yes. not that I dislike you guys that I put you over there. It's because you're facing left. No, it's, that, I mean, yeah, that makes sense. It'd be, it would make sense. Facing <laughs> left discrimination. <laughs> <laughs> no, that makes sense. No, it's you can flip them, you know. Keen, keen. I think. What? I think really? Yeah, yeah. I, yeah, I thought we would have click, to flip uh, ourselves. Or you nope. right click, flip. Right click in OBS, transform, and then. Oh, yeah. I could just flip them? Mm -hmm. Oh. I feel like I knew that and I just forgot. Oh. I can put Keen in the corner. That's me in the corner. I'm grounded. <laughs> That's me in the spot. Light losing, losing it by my religion. religion. There you go. <laughs> Wouldn't it have been losing my reflection? No. Because I can't see shit because I'm in the corner. <laughs> <laughs> That's me in the corner. And time and out. Time. I don't even know what I did. <laughs> time out. Losing all my playtime. Losing my conviction. There you go. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, we'll do that Monster Hunter story stream, and I'll I'll uh, voice actor of Mailing plays Monster Hunter stories. Nubby and King singing the song SpongeBob sang uh, when he had to work at the Chum Bucket. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> this grill is not a home <laughs> without you. Not a patty. He's not a patty. It's time to look at candy corn. What are you strong against? You're strong against tech, so. Trying to remember where this I had to look up the lyrics for that song. Oh, you're still just a I'm inside, sorry. They <laughs> spat me out back indoors. I know. We weren't in a party anymore, so there's no way for me to know where you were. I know. Oh, God. Cool kids only. 
Yeah, that's no, no, no. That's how I feel. The cool kids are all over there, and I'm over here. <laughs> I'll have to make friends with my feet and my little hands. With my Gang's up, all up, here. I have to make friends with my, with my feet. Gang's all here. I've got oh, Penny, God. Chip, and used napkin. No. Welcome to Keen makes as many SpongeBob challenge uh, references as possible. Oh, I'm gonna be here yeah. all night. <laughs> oh, I got him. Let me tell him to roll up my sleeves. <laughs> Alucard, don't get in the way, buddy. Please, 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 please. That wasn't just any reference. That was advanced reference. Advanced reference. <laughs> <laughs> Only Keen had a bubble buddy. Yeah. Just need a little bubble. You are your own bubble buddy. I guess we I can make my own Pippin bubbles. Here. I'm a. Oh man, you're Pippin right. This little slime could be Bubble Buddy. Yeah. Oh, this guy can heal. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna have to try this again, and I'm gonna have to use cards. Oof. Oh my god. I just looked here. I wanted hit point. Oh my god. Yeah. No, Shit. didn't go great. Ouch. <laughs> the death animation for the pterodactyls like a little. You're just like. <laughs> Like jeez, a little brutal. Let's try that again. <laughs> it's yeah. very birds falling out of the sky no! during rapture. <laughs> oh my god, yeah, a little, that's a weird way to put it, but you're exactly right. You're exactly correct. <laughs> but you're yeah, very good. Yeah, we do need the clown. Do I have clown? I do have clown. Oh, try clown. It is a, a sign. It is a sign yeah. of the coming of the end times when the pterodactyls fall from their heights. <laughs> oh my god. Can you imagine? You see, the dinosaurs, they didn't actually die off or disappear or anything. The yeah, land roaming did. dinosaurs just went underground. Don't talk about fossils. And the pterodactyls, they just went up, 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 up. <laughs> It no, that's the reason off. that the fossils are underground is because that's where the dinosaurs died. And the reason we don't see them when we fly in planes or with our satellites is because they're shy. And, you know, actually, um, <laughs> fossils weren't <laughs> caused by the meteor impact and all of that. It was actually the dirt. When the dinosaurs went underground, the dirt got mad at them. <laughs> Oops. And the dirt, the, and then the dirt formed into rock mm -hmm. and made fun of the dinosaurs and it was like, eh, this is what you look like. This is <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit, no <laughs> <laughs> That's you. That's what you look like. And that is how history remembered them. <laughs> Fuck, that's funny. Um, sorry, I'm, putting right, I'm not alone anymore. There you go. I'm just eating the bee's hair. Yum, yum, yum. That's there a joke go. no one can ever make again. Yum, 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 yum. Here's, everybody who looks at this character I designed is like, your hair looks so eatable. It looks like string cheese. You have string cheese hair. I'm sick of it. Honestly, the first <laughs> time I saw it, I thought like, man, hair. you could like take off like like those top ones that are just like three bars of hair and you could like use those like swords or like blades or something that's the first it kind of looks like, like paper i thought that earlier i was like man you just like take that off and like throw it like a sword or something Boomer. the idea was it was supposed to look very paper crafty no that makes just, sense like, flat ribbons and stuff like a paper man mm -hmm. and then all my friends were like haha cheese head <laughs> <laughs> like you're boy. mean to me <laughs> I'm not a cheese boy. I'm We're gonna have not. one of those like fondue nights where you dip things in the cheese and the melty cheese. And we're just gonna have to melt your hair to make it happen. Sorry, we'll put it back. Whatever's left. <laughs> this is like a picture of fondue, and then there's a picture of like my little guy, and it's like, is it worth it? <laughs> oh shit! Yes. Am I kind of level? What? Oh, it's because I'm not wearing the outfit. Oh. I, mean, I, I think I did that like once, like like over a decade ago, my family and I did the thing where it's like, yeah, take things and dip it in the melty cheese. And like, it was pretty good. But, uh, I don't know, just haven't had the opportunity to do it since, I'm I guess. I'm gonna need to leave again any minute now. <laughs> uh, well, one of these, you're able to do at a party. <laughs> I don't know which one. Bone bones? I just wanna know where you are. Tiger, what is it? Okay. I really want this guy to stop doing things. 
I don't like the way the clown moves. Yeah. The clown scares me. Just He's useful though. Even beyond just my natural advert aversion to clowns he's oh freaky. oh are you afraid of clowns i yeah it's a thing but like that one is weird <laughs> what is such a western fear it like, sure why? is is it because of it or like horror movie clowns when it's like hey i think clowns are scary the and it's red big whole yeah. thing i got you Thanks. go on i'll i'll cover you Go on I got you back. Go on ahead. You gotta protect <laughs> us from the clowns. No, a giant frog was attacking I'll hold me. Hold them while off. I Get out. All right, you guys are in Final Fantasy, all right? Yeah, they're they're playing a completely different game. Right, right, right. right. <laughs> I forgot. I love just hearing Nubby's character screaming in the background, like ah! <laughs> I'll hold them off. Get out. <laughs> Al, come on, bud, sit down. Come here. What a joy that was to play. Well. Mm -hmm. <sighs> I gotta get the hang on this the, timing. That's the peak of dudes rock. Yeah. Dudes Hell rock. Yeah. That looked pretty spot on. How's that a wolf? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Tiger, what? You wanna play it? You are already dead. Thing. thing on the screen? Want to put your face on it? Okay. Wanna come up instead? No. We're all dealing with indecisive kitty cats. Tiger, what is it? Want me to follow you around for a bit? Is that it? Okay. Let's go. Where we're going. Nog in stores already? What? Ash Nog. Crazy. Alright. Now I've used all my cards. So I'm not being silly. missing that second attack. And there goes my pterodactyl. It's alright, I got clown. Clown's really useful. <laughs> make you laugh. Make you cry. Make you cry? Make I don't you scream. I don't think Sometimes he can revive. Die. I'm not 100% sure, though. I would try it, but I can totally just kill this guy. I don't know if it has anything to do with anything. But I was very close with my grandfather when he was still alive, and apparently he also hated clowns. Oh, yeah, that's probably his fault. <laughs> I thought you were implying it was genetic. <laughs> Genetic Wait, clown hate. It's just, just a coincidence <laughs> more than anything. My grandfather, who I never met, also hated clowns. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Give me that candy. Clown is going to say we should consider the upgrade. Yeah, that's a good point. I could probably afford it. Where is the dude that sells the upgrades? He's in the sewers, right? Meow. Following him did nothing. Well, I pet him. He, sometimes he wants me to pet him while he eats. It's like his favorite thing. And then I did, and he was done. Clown upgrade. Meow. What's up, little man? Meow. What, do what do you want? 
<laughs> People are spamming Moxie emo, but that's that's just me, baby. How do you spell that? Because I was looking for that song and I couldn't find it. M I A O M I O. Okay, oh, yeah, I wouldn't figure that out. <laughs> 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 Wow. Oh, look at my upgraded clown. Yeah, whoa. Yo. Oh, cool. So many colors. I do like that. That's good. Oh, I can't use them again. Uh oh, gamers. Is in his bone candy corn. Stop healing, you bitch. How dare you. That's rough. Yeah, AoE would be, um, I think, superhero. But I want to use the pterodactyl. No, I will not fall. I'm keeping candy corn. I've almost got it. Shit. That's not good. Don't like that. Yeah, I know. Oh my god. basically screwed. As soon as the clown goes down, we're we're out. Oh. Bye, Nub. Bye. All right. Well, <laughs> I could try switching in different cards. I'm sure I have cards that could help. Let's see. Um, here. Single full heal. Which 
chosen hero ignored by enemies. Chosen hero takes two turns. Splash attack. Splash damage on all attacks. Okay. How about that? Two times attack damage for the next three attacks. That's also good. Nubbins! Nubby's you. Ho 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 ho! It's, it's some... It's, wow, what, what are those fucking, like, shysters? <laughs> <laughs> those are Veggie Tail. Yeah. They do look like Veggie Tail. That big one talks like this. <laughs> yeah, he does. <laughs> yeah, let's try that. Hey, right, come on, buddy. Nubby face reveal, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you have to defeat the drones to get the wizard outfit. Oh, okay. At least there's barely any consequence for dying. You literally just get sent back to your last heal place. Here we go. Jesus. feels really like tight and I can't uh, I can't move it too far back yeah I could be using the superhero but uh, I like pterodactyl <laughs> I guess then I can't complain when I get destroyed, though. I didn't see a Terra upgrade. I'm doing all right with cards, though. I got, I got it. We're good. I got it. Nice, nice. No Provalo. Yeah, I'm trying.
There we go. The costume meta. I gotta beat these guys. Oh, there's three of them. monster. Don't target my pterodactyl. Target candy corn. That's what he's here for. Not quite. That sucks. Candy corn fears no man. Candy corn is a bug. Candy corn kind. Yeah, if I'm going to do another robot fight, I'll switch off the pterodactyl. <laughs> Clearly, not the best matchup. Pterodactyls are weak against robots. If only there was some way to have known. <laughs> I got him.
Yeah, relax, man. I got you. I've not been paying attention to what cards I've been picking up. Okay, there's one. So if they're mostly tech, I should put on Jefferson. Try that on for size. Oh, two of them are monster. Great. <laughs> well, that's all right. I'll pack this one. Great. Neither of you are good against it. Almost. Candy Corm's going for the long con, that's right. <laughs> I'm keeping it up. I want that achievement. Kids remind me of El Tigre. Oh, a hundred percent. This is mm -hmm. so like in that vein of design or like art direction, I guess. What a weird era of cartoons that El, El Tigre was a part of. Mm. show was like my absolute shit when I was mm. like really young like I, I'd go crazy over Dragon Tales yeah mm, fucking love Dragon Tales that that was that was the one you know Dragon Tales was good every time Dragon Tales was on my sister and I would be there we'd go crazy I know you're getting thirsty. It's hard being candy corn. Give me all the candy. 
Let's go. All right, glow stick. Not bad, not bad. What, what types were these guys? The guys that are in the houses. I feel like there was there were tech guys, so I should probably stay on Jefferson. Mages in tech, yeah. There we go. Good night, Lily. Thanks for stopping by. Bye bye. Bye. Let's see how much later I go. It's getting a little late. Mm -hmm. How do I get there? Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> Oops, I didn't switch my costume back. Shit. <laughs> Oh, but these are different guys. Okay, this is an even spread. So, whatever. He heals too. Okay. You die first. Flair's baby. Oh, you grew up with different shows than us because you're younger than us. Yeah. I was watching cartoons in the 90s, baby. A lot of those newer cartoons I never even watched. You're 22? That's still pretty baby. To me, that's baby. I also just didn't, I didn't like watching TV that much as far as like cartoons were concerned. I was more interested in like going online and watching anime. Super little, um, my favorite cartoon was Ed, Ed, and Eddie. Oh, yeah. That was the one I was watching all the times. Ed, Ed, and Eddie's good. That's a, that's a, that's a classic. I, 
I did like boycott Cartoon Network for a while though. Why? Because they kept playing fucking um, Billy and Mandy right after Codename Kid This Next Door would come on, and I fucking hated Billy and Mandy. Oh, I loved Billy and Mandy. <laughs> It was just creepy. I just didn't like that, it. That's what I liked Freaked about it. <laughs> hello, hello. Hey, Piff. Hey, Piff. Hi, Piff. Oh, man, the creepy one was Courage the Cowardly Dog. That was the yeah, that one was awesome, heard. too. Uh, like, I in couldn't a cross that I, line. I could do Courage the Cowardly Dog. I couldn't do Really? Any. There are different flavors of creepy. Courage the Cowardly Dog is, like, more eerie. And then, like, Billy and Mandy's, like, in your face, like, all, like, just barely not gore. <laughs> I'm like, I don't <laughs> like this. I generally disagree. There is a lot of, like, pretty, like... How do I put this? I think it was intentionally being like more a altered like trying to be like surreal surreal terror in Courage of the Cowardly Dog, where like Billy Mandy was just like, there's a skeleton guy, there's an idiot kid, there's the evil mastermind child. Um and a lot of the things are like very round and almost cute, like Fred. You gotta understand. I, as a kid, I couldn't, I couldn't read like the, oh, what's it called? There's, there's a book, there's a children's book about idioms. And it's about this kid who hears idioms like, give me a hand, or has the cat got your tongue, or things like that, and imagines himself losing his body parts and falling apart. That, that book freaked me out as a kid. So if you show me the TV show where, like, I see a main character without their skin in the opening, <laughs> I don't want to watch it. <laughs> Fair enough. I also feel like the first episode you watch of something also has a huge impact on whether or not you continue to watch it. Yeah. Uh, because, like, there were some shows where I would see one episode and I'd be like, I'm never watching that again. And, like, maybe the show was fine. But if you get a bad episode as your intro, it's not going to happen. Also, Noob Nisha, first time chatter, welcome. Thanks for following. We're playing way, Costume Quest 2. I should mention that I have nothing against Courage the Cowardly Dog. I just, as a kid, I was just like, oh. Oh, yeah, no. I, I loved it, it, but there were a handful of episodes I could not watch. I, I'm, I'm probably, totally I'm probably the reverse. I'm probably, like, the handful of episodes everyone, like, goes like, oh, that really creepy. It's like, those are the ones I like. <laughs> the episode that I could not stand was the Flan episode, if you remember that. I do remember that one. That one was, yeah, kind of just weird. Um, that one scared me. Uh, the, I couldn't deal with it. The one that a lot of people talk about is the, was it like the hair cutter? Um, where like he just monologues through the entire episode with this big smile. Um, where he, like, uh, he ends everything. Like, everything, like, I've been very... Naughty. Naughty. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I'm like, oh, I love that one. I love the uh, the freaking like weird mummy that's just floating out. I love that King one. Ramesses. That's great. Yeah. Return yeah. the slab. Pull it's so funny because like, like when you watch that as a kid, you're like, that dude was like a skeleton and he had no face. And then you watch it now, it's like, no, he has a face. He's actually kind of a normal guy. He just has lips that make him look weird. Because <laughs> he's like an embalmed Egypt mummy man. Well, he's not even right, no. really that much of a like. Like if you go back, because I don't know, this was my experience. Is I saw that footage again recently because I oh, watched I like a think. dissertation on Courage the Cowardly Dog. But I went back and I watched it, watched that clip and I saw the rem the the render of King Ramses and I was like, wow, that's way more just normal and tame than I remember it being as a kid. Because mm. I remember it being like the creepiest fucking shit I've ever seen. <laughs> okay. There were there were episodes that I think rightly unnerved me, even if I didn't know why at the time. 
there's a whole there's like a there's like there's a whole episode about domestic abuse in Courage the Cowardly Dog, and that one oh, freaked shit. me out as a kid. Damn. Yeah, they go into some weird things in that. Also, you said love the Avi. Thank you so much. Oh. I appreciate it. Okay, I remembered to switch costumes this time. Except now he's strong against monster weak against tech. I swear he was strong against tech when I was equipping him. What is happening? I played this game too long ago, I don't remember. Might be randomized? Why would it be randomized? See, now you're strong against Magic Weekend's monster. Yo, there's a Barbie girl hanging out over here. Is she in the Barbie world? She's looking at it. She's staring off into space, just chilling. Dude, life is plastic. It's fantastic. Fantastic. You okay there? <laughs> <laughs> Life is plastic. And why shouldn't it be? Yeah. Oh. It's life in plastic. In plastic. <laughs> is fantastic. There you go. I am stupid. <laughs> Don't mean me. I'm not being mean. Just I know, correcting I know. your factual I know. inaccuracies. I, I know. I'm just, <laughs> I'm just, I'm just a stupid little guy. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Insulting me so hard tonight, Nubby. I am not. <laughs> <laughs> I am not. I have never. I did not. I did not. Not quite healing. Almost there. Could probably survive one more turn. Oops, not if I don't hit the block. Haha, uh, oops. Haha, uh, oops. Did <laughs> not I killed him. That's pretty good. Ooh. Wow. 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 Confession time. I I have always thought it was that. <laughs> ever since I was like ever since I've heard Barbie that song. I I, I just always thought life is plastic. It's fantastic. I, and I never questioned it. <laughs> <laughs> it's just like one of those things, you know? <laughs> to be fair, if an Aqua song had weird grammar, I would not question it either. Aqua kind of just did whatever the hell they wanted. Yeah. I'm very amused by your pronunciation. Aqua? No, you're saying Aqua. You said Aqua. Aqua? Yeah. Like, they're, they're both right. I know they are, but like... Usually, you'll never hear people say aqua. Aqua. It's the New York. Uh, yeah, no, it is. Mm -hmm. It's the New York, or you were gonna say ABBA, and you, like, hard pivoted because he realized. Because <laughs> <laughs> I realized. <laughs> Came to your senses. Mm hmm <laughs> Yeah, we say aqua, and we say walk, walk. and we say dog. Dog. <laughs> and water. You're putting a little too much you in there. It's just dog. 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 <laughs> yeah, like I'm, I'm not crazy. He's strong against tech, but when I got into that battle, he wasn't anymore. Hmm. Vixen, how do you say Mario? Mario. It's not Mario. 
everybody who I've heard say Mario is one never like it never because they are from like a like a East Coast anywhere. It's never that reason, and it's always in the context of saying Mario Kart, and it's never oh, just yeah. Mario or Mario Party, <laughs> and it, that's the only times I've ever heard. I feel like Mario is just the, like, boomer mispronunciation mm -hmm. in the same way that they would say, like, Pokemons. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's just, like, you're talking to someone who doesn't know anything about video games. They're going to say Mario. Yeah. Getting sleepy? Me? Yeah. A little. You're yombadin. I'm sorry. You don't have to apologize. I'm just pointing it I out. I didn't mean to. Please <laughs> forgive me. Shit, there goes my clown. That's not good. Purchasing a lottery. So I gamble. I gamble. The winning numbers 1984. Rick, what's your, what, what, what year were you born? Nineteen ninety-six. Uh, no. Ninety-four. No. Ninety-two. Yes. Okay. Eighty-one. <laughs> no, no. Thirty-seven. Whoa. The future. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! And it's funny because you're playing a time travel game. Wow. And you're from the future? Wow. 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 You're right, Flair. I was born in 1208. Uh, you know. Been doing this reindeer gig a long time. Think about that. Think about reindeers real hard. <laughs> Drop the skincare routine? Demonic possession. <laughs> Sorry, hard to replicate. Holding up a picture of an Allosaurus. Do you know him? <laughs> Does he know? You know this guy? Where is he? Wizard, let's go. What does wizard do? Oh, the lights. That's what I need to go in the thing. I got it. I understand. Uh, what's my quest log say? I still got a bunch of stuff to do in this area. Hey, gamers, I tell you what. Mm. I've been going four hours and it's late. Mm. I think it's time to call it. Okay. Fair. But they said this game's like six and a half hours and I've done four, so th that's pretty good, unless mm. I've been faffing oh, yeah. around too much and it's mm. not going to actually happen. There we are. Hello. All right, let's find somebody to raid. Guys, thank you all so much for coming tonight. I hope you enjoyed our first spoopy day. Whoa. And uh, we'll we'll do more we'll do more Halloween-y type streams soon. Um nobody we know is on. Uh let's raid Kenji. I love Kenji. We're all here. <laughs> yeah, you guys are all here. You are all here. <laughs> all right, there we go. Ourselves. Uh, guys, make sure you hit him with the with with our uh, with our raid emote. Give him a nice Merry Christmas, and uh, I will see you all next time. Good night, my dears. Bye bye. Bye. Okay, bye, -bye. <laughs> <laughs>